Athens raced here over the shorter journey as they box away. Race number two, we've been given a green light here. This is race number two at Murray Bridge. Set, favourite is Rogue Player, the seven, ready. Lids up, they're away and racing. Now, favourite was only away fairly. Millie May won the start. Albuquerque going quickly. Finnis Blossom was next. Jet Age starting to muster. Then Queen Mears near the rear. Well, Rogue Player would have to do a lot to win from there, but is starting to motor up towards the front. In front, Millie May by length to Jet Age. On the scene, Rogue Player out three wide. Rogue Player starting to storm down the outside from Jet Age. Rogue Player with a big barnstorming run. Jet Age, Rogue Player. Rogue Player rolled Jet Age. Third, then came Albuquerque. Next across the line was Finnis Blossom, Queen Mears and Millie May. Wow, rogue player. Had to put in the big bounds late to get the job done, but was able to score here. It'll be 7 4 8 across the line in a time of 25 76. He put the riding uh, on the wall down the back, uh, rogue player, when it started to pick up down the side into that turn. Jet Age kicked pretty strongly, but uh, wasn't good enough to hold on in the end. Albuquerque ran third, five ran fourth. Numbers here are seven, four, eight, five. Time, 25.76. Trained and owned by Stephen Brook, a dog by Alan Deed out of Fancy Gun. Career start number five, win number two. Well, the market had that right. Jet Age, the second favourite, ran second. Trained by Vern Anderson. Pitched by Barcia Bale out of Lagoon Prissy. Eight ran third, Albuquerque. As we said before, the race had some specking. Dog by Fernando Bale out of Cosmic VB. And the five ran fourth, Millie May, pitched by a truly special out of Tell the World, trained by Lisa Rasmussen. Seven four eight five. Time was twenty five seventy six.